Good morning, Patriots. Welcome to Rex Pines TV. I'm Peyton Forbes. May you please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. And now for our school mission statement. We the Patriots achieve greatness through high expectations, passion, and perseverance. Thank you. You may now be seated. Today is Thursday, April 28th, 2022. Now it's time to take a brain break. Inhale, let the waves gently rise. And exhale, let the waves fall. Inhale, the waves rise. And exhale, the waves fall. Take some calming ocean breaths in and out at your own pace. That was just what I needed to start off this great day. Now let's go to word of the day. So Alex, did your chickens hatch yet? Yes, they actually emerged yesterday. Wow, really? I didn't think they would come out this early. Yeah, me neither. But I'm happy they emerged because now the fun really begins. Maybe I can come over and see some of them. Yeah, that would be great. See, see you tomorrow, tomorrow on, on Word of the Day. day. The sports facts are about to emerge with Scott. Thank you, Peyton. Today's highlight sure is a knockout. Sports fans, the boxing world is buzzing with news of world heavyweight champion Tyson Fury's decision to retire last week. The British professional boxer and two-time world champion retained his title after stopping Dylan White in the sixth round. Fury has now fought 26 fights and remains unbeaten. He made a promise to his family before the last fight to retire, and so far it looks like he's keeping it. This might be the final curtain for the Gypsy King, Fury said in the ring, with his WBC and Ring Magazine belts around his shoulders. What a way to go out. Now let's see what's cooking with Sonia. Thank you, Scott. Today's lunch sure is scrumptious. It is pancakes and sausage, seasoned diced potatoes, sunspots veggie juice, diced pears, syrup, and your choice of milk. Don't forget to let your teachers know if you will be receiving them today. Good appetit. Let's go. Back to Peyton. Thank you, Sonia. I sure do love having breakfast for lunch. Patriots, the FSA pep rally is tomorrow. It sure is worth the hype. Make sure you're there to get pumped up for the FSA. Make sure to come to school tomorrow so you don't miss it. The academic celebrations are today through Friday. Today is for third and fifth grade, and tomorrow is for sixth to eighth grade. Congrats to the students that have received an award. Patriots, the hero store is open. Get there by 7.15 a.m. to avoid the lines. Sports fans, our girls' flag football team has a game today against RASG. The game starts at 4 p.m. Let's go, Patriots. Now let's see what the weather is going to be like today with Randy. I hope it's nice and sunny. Hey, Patriots. For today's weather, you can expect 85 degrees Fahrenheit with showering skies. We're likely to have some rain, so if you're going out, you've been warned. In other weather news, a new species of deep sea jellyfish was discovered. In Monterey Bay, California, scientists identified a new species of Atola jellyfish. What's unique about this species is that it lacks a super long tentacle that you would typically see on other deep sea jellyfish. Researchers named the jellyfish Atola Reynolds in honor of the first volunteer. Now let's go to Chanel for today's birthdays. Thank you, Randy. Today's birthday boys and girls are Abigail Pace, Sakia Hilton, and Tori Bean. Happy birthday, now let's go back to Peyton. Thank you, Chanel, and happy birthday, Patriots. Here are your Pat's expectations. They represent, present yourself positively, act kindly towards others, treat the school's environment respectfully, and succeed at everything. 
Now for yesterday's trivia winners. Congrats to Miss Manon, Miss Velez, Miss Stone, Miss Cavalita, Miss Samuel, Miss Newton, Miss June, Miss Only, Miss Shadid, and Miss Iam Dengkwa. You all had the correct answer to yesterday's trivia question, which was, which British girl group had a member by the name of Mel B? The correct answer is Spice Girls. Now, teachers and scholars, here's today's trivia question. What is the hottest planet in the solar system? Teachers, please send your answers to pines.renaissance at gmail.com before 10 a.m. in order for your response to be reviewed. Everyone at RPTV will like to wish you all a thoughtful Thursday. And don't forget, this year we are all about fundamentals and forward focus. Have a great day!